Hello and welcome to the Bonsai Garden. I've actually been suffering with COVID for the past week or so. Fortunately, it's just been like a bad cold, but I have managed to avoid it for two years. And although I'm fully dosed up with the vaccines, I have managed to catch it. Fortunately, uh, I'd say it's just like a bad cold and I'm getting through that. But what I wanted to bring to you today was something a little bit different. So I've got in front of me here a Chinese juniper, which was a cutting which I took. Um, it was actually an air layering off the top of another tree that I bought from Elmbrook Bonsai. And uh, I separated that in about September time and placed it into this little plastic training pot. I'm now thinking about what I might do with that going forward in terms of repotting. And I've got a number of options in terms of pots. So I'm going to present them to you and see what your thoughts are in the comments. And I'm going to repot it into the pot which the largest number of people think is the most suited. So if I start from this side, I've got a little Zisha red river clay pot, which I bought from Amazon. Now it's a nice round pot, it's got some little, little feet on it. And that's my pot number one as a candidate and if I just pop that in front of the tree there now it's quite a small pot but um, I suspect that the roots in here aren't as extensive as they might first appear uh, that's probably quite spacious in that pot so I'm sure that I would be able to get that into there the other thing is that Chinese juniper don't mind having their roots constrained so that's my pot number one. Pot number two is this lovely little studded drum pot from Hinata Ceramics. See another round pot. Studded effect on the rim. Some feet on there. Again, it's quite shallow and looks quite small compared to the existing pot but because I'm fairly convinced that the roots aren't massively extensive in there. So here's how that potentially might look. So that's pot number two, my Hinata Ceramics drum pot. This is pot number three, another Zisha Red River Clay Chinese pot. I think again, this came as part of the set with pot number one. So this is pot number three, another round pot. And there is potentially my tree sat in that particular pot. And then finally, I have this little rectangular pot. Now this is the pot that the larger of my white pine trees came in, the tree that I bought from All Things Bonsai. And I felt that it was a little bit under potted in this pot, so I moved that onto a slightly larger pot. But it does mean, obviously, that I now have this particular pot free. So that's my pot number four. And that's potentially how the tree will look in pot number four. So let me know what your thoughts are. Would you prefer the tree in pot number one? Pot number two. Pot number three and pot number four. So leave your thoughts in the comments below. 
let me know which you believe makes the better pot for this particular tree and I'll give it perhaps a month of comments and then I'll take whichever is the most popular of those and I'll repot this tree into that particular pot. So thanks for watching and hope to catch you on the next one.